thank you. We have shown you that sooner or later you will understand. It's all down to experience. Experience, ladies and gentlemen. And that's absolutely true. You should laugh at it. Maybe it takes some people more time than others, but we do believe that all people possess this common wisdom and common sense in order to understand their interests and to find the best way, the better party to articulate their interests and to act in their interests. And another very important consequence, dear ladies and gentlemen, it is social consequence, uh, meaning that the poorest people, the most socially disadvantaged people, already in many countries uh, constitute the majority. In many countries, they constitute a vast part of the population. If we make them politically disadvantaged, dear ladies and gentlemen, of course that may not be so important for the state and the first uh, stage, but that will be really considerably important for their own self-identification and their own self-understanding. They will ask the question, why is it so? We are, un uh, you know, just we have underperformed in uh, economic terms and social terms, etc., and we are politically disadvantaged. And that will, dear ladies and gentlemen, entail a social upheaval of those people who are marginal and who have a lot to, who have nothing to risk and they have nothing to dare in their lives. So, dear ladies and gentlemen, for the fact that political culture is different from education, and for the fact that we're not going to trigger all these uh, really disastrous social consequences, we beg you to oppose. Thank you. Thank you very much.